I'm TapTap, and welcome to... What? <laughs> they, they changed it to what? Oh no! Yes, Abyssrium World has changed its name um, from Abyssrium World Tap Tap Fish to Hello Whale Idle Aquarium, which has none of the original name in it, not even a single spec. They they spent four years building up this brand, and they 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 piss it into a bucket with with with, with this. Oh, and there's a season pass. Of course, there's a fucking season pass, and it's just it's just a bunch of fish from the other games. Oh, what a disaster! Oh my god, it's just fish from Abyssrium. Oh god, I feel so sorry for anyone who still plays this crap. Oh man, hello whale. Hello, Marta. So that's wow. I'm I'm a stunned. This actually let me play on emulator this time though. I it usually just doesn't work. I almost didn't do a video just because it's such a pain in the butt to try to like load. Uh, so this is Abyssrium World and f search engine optimization is a thing, you know, guys. So I this is almost certainly my last video on this dumbass game. Um, <laughs> if, you, if you can't tell, I'm pretty much done. Um, because like, what do I call my videos now? Do I call it Hello Vale? I the Aquarium. Yes, Yahoo. No, like, do I, like, how, how am I gonna fit all four goddamn names of this stupid game into the title and hope that people know which one to click on? Um, plus is, what is this, like a, a blue scale? What, what are these? It's some kind of like raging dumpster fire icon, I can't tell what that is. There's a box of whale poop over here, let's get the whale poop. Oh, it's snow. Right. Um, so I don't really have too much to say to, about this other than just like... <laughs> What the hell, guys? Abyssrium was a really cool idea. It um, For the first couple of years of its life, it was great. It had a huge community. I can't stress enough. This game had millions of players. This game must have raked in money hand over fist. This game, the, the series, um, back when it was Idle Idea Factory, back before um, early in the Cheetah Mobile days, there was so many people. There were tens of thousands of views. Every single video I put out, tens of thousands of views within the first... 24 hours. I would see a huge spike. My, my website would sometimes briefly go down just because so many people viewed it. Uh, now it's barely even more popular than like a random video of a game that nobody's ever heard of. And I like doing videos of games nobody's ever heard of. Check out some of those videos. Come on. Expand your palette. Be, be, be more be more open to things. Get a snow wreath recipe. Oh god, look at all these equipments we need. There's three different... You gotta get a blue fruit branch. It's completely frozen, but the fruit has sweet juice. Um, so there's three goddamn materials for this thing now. So everything is just... This game always sucked, frankly. It's fun for the first couple days. That's the same for every mobile game. Every mobile game, they front load you with fun. They trick you into thinking it's good. Um, they showed you, like, there's new content every, you know, 20 minutes or so. And it just... It, it stretches thinner and thinner as it goes on, and eventually, you're just stuck grinding the same thing. Like, in this game, it's just, okay, you collect your stupid thing from here, from here, you gotta make the seaweed. I always hate this gameplay, the, the, the farm stuff, ugh. Then you gotta go, how do you even do this? Exploration. You gotta send out a bunch of crap, and then you gotta wait, and then you gotta send out crap again, and then you wait, and then you, ugh. It's just an infinite loop. Every every mobile game is basically this exact same thing, which is why I don't really play almost anything. Even Genshin Impact, which is better than most, is like it still has this exploration crap. In fact, it's so pointless in, in Genshin Impact. I'm stunned they even have it at all. Um, you get almost nothing for it in Genshin Impact, which is kind of fortunate, but because it's not like this, where it's just like your whole life is like, okay, I'm gonna send out. How long do these take? I'm gonna wait an hour, and then I'm gonna open the game, and then I'm gonna do exactly what I just did. Again, and then I'm gonna open it in an hour, and then I'm gonna do exactly what I just did, and then there's the event pass. Let's see how much this money money this costs. Oh no, don't bring up my thing. Oh, it's eight bucks. My purchase has been cancelled. So so eight bucks and you can get these you can get some Bernie Sanders mittens. But not real ones. You know, I'd pay eight bucks for some Bernie Sanders mittens, but they'd have to be like real ones that warm my real hands. Like, my digital hands, they don't get cold. They're digital. I don't need digital mittens, you know? I have 50 friends, good God. Coral tree fragments. I, I still love that, that, that Facebook is back in this one. They, they, they nuked the Facebook in the old one because, um, 
because of, um, well, th there was a bug and they didn't want to fix it. That's, that's genuinely what happened. I'm not even exaggerating. Uh, there's a wider world waiting out there. Now, one of the things that I hated about this game, uh, hated is perhaps excessive. It was at the time, anyway. It's not anymore. But one thing I never really liked was that it started out with events. And I was like, wait a minute. If they start doing events, are they ever going to update the main game? And as far as I'm aware, they haven't. The only real update I've seen is that they changed the name to Poopy Buttholes, McGee, uh, whatever it is, Idle Aquarium. Which, Hello Whale? If you Google Hello Whale, you don't get this goddamn game. I don't I have no idea what they were thinking. You Google Hello Whale, you get a kid's book, you get, like, memes. That's right, Parker. You can sense my agitation. That's right! Oh, you got squeaks in your voice! There you go. What's up? Hi. What's up, Parker? Oh, you're squeaky today. Is your throat dry? I got a new humidifier and to replace one of my broken ones and still not. It's still like 31% humidity. I hate winter so much. Um, it's, it's nice to look at in video games, but in real life it's like, oh, kill me. Uh, so... Yeah, this game does not show up if you Google Hello Whale, so I think I'm just going to leave my videos called, uh, you know, Abyssrium Worlds, and maybe they'll, like, realize they're dumb butts and change it back, but I, at this point, I, I just basically don't care. I, I really, I really just don't care. If, if it's going to be a big pain in the butt to try to chase clout for this game that has only 100,000 downloads, which is, it sounds like a lot, but compared to Abyssrium, like, the original Abyssrium is, like, several million, so... The, the, the drop-off was really precipitous and well-deserved, frankly. They, Flero Games has done a terrible job. What happened to that Switch version? There was going to be a Switch version, and they just didn't. They were just like, nah, let's not do that. Also, if you're wondering why I'm not zooming, because this game's not really very mouse-friendly. Playing on my, uh, on Nox Player. So, what else is there to even say? Sleepy boy. Sleepy boy. So yeah, this game was always kind of a grind. It does visually look nice, I will give them that. It has like a nice visual style that does set it apart from the original game. Just a little bit. It's still recognizable as Abyssrium. Um, these things creep me out, by the way. It's like a person with like, f like different kinds of flesh growing in their body. Like, I, I, it makes me uncomfortable, I don't like it. Also this thing, I hate this thing in particular, Sea Dog. Get, and, and the Sea Raccoon, I don't like either of these. I put them here, that's like Dingus Island, I don't like them. Um, yeah. It could have been cool. I think, the, the, like I said, the biggest thing was they never updated the game. They never put more game in this game. They just pooped it out all at once, and then it's just events, and the events... The event fish are hideous, for the most part. Um, how do I even see... Like, what fish do you even get? Oh, that's just from the... That's just from Abyssrium! Oh my god, guys, these are all... <laughs> these are all just recycled! Oh, they're not even new fish anymore! They're less ugly, but that's because they're aw. Oh. But yeah, m most of the uh, most of the new fish in this game look like they have like parasites eating their brains. You know the ones I mean. Uh, these things, like they have like Metroids eating their brains, and even without the Metroid, that's an ugly ass fish. I'm sorry. I'm sorry if anyone looks like that fish, but yeah, not. No, I'm not going to prom with that. Um. So yeah, it's literally, the whole got into this same rut, where it's just mostly reused stuff from the original game. And this got even, this got it even worse. So like, there's no new content in this game, basically. If you've already played Abyssrium, it's all, you've already, you've already seen the fish. Uh, you've already seen the fish that they add in the events, and they're easier to get in regular Abyssrium. It's still, you know, watch ads, the movie, the sequel, the animated series, the movie again. But it's... It's just worse in here. Uh, it's a shame. For like a week, it seemed like maybe this could be okay if they keep adding to it. And they never added anything. It was just events. Oh well. And wh what happened to hide and Hidden Fish? That was the one thing. The thing with this game, it's a single player game. There's no real reason to have a community. But the Hidden Fish, it was like, oh, um, I, I want to get... Guys, I want to get the... Um, I want to get the... Uh, the, 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 the I'm looking. Uh, I want. I want to get the the. the, what the hell is that? Um, the Atlantic Sea Nettle. It looks neat. How do I get it, guys? And it'd be like, oh, it's. You gotta. You know, there'll be a hidden unlock requirements. Like, oh, you gotta buy five of these seahorses. Turn your phone sideways, and you know, 
double click and then you get it. And that was exciting, that was fun. And so all of us were like, oh man, there's a new fish. How do you get the new fish? Every single update, it would be like, we'd rush to the subreddit, to the discords, uh, to YouTube. And we'd be like, oh, how do we get the thing? How do we get the thing? And there'd be this rush of excitement. And now, now whenever there's a new event, an event, it's like, hey, purchase the event pass and grind 16,000 hours to get a snow flower. And then you get a fish that you already got three years ago in a different game. Oh. Thanks. Thanks. Oh, it still says Abyssrium, by the way. A friend visiting Abyssrium, except it's not. It's Hello Whale. Jeez. Come on. Do you think this looks like Abyssrium? No, this is Hello Whale. It's, it's my original character, Hello Whale. Come on, guys. Jeez. Get your head in the game. What a disaster. Follow me on YouTube, though, yes. Production info. Oh, I see. <laughs> so, um, unless this game is like a complete overhaul, and hopefully they change the freaking name back. Uh, see, I was ex I was hopeful. Like, the Abyssrium World started, was the first part of the name, and then they added Tap Tap Fish. I've always hated the name. Which, by the way, to let me dispel this like every video, Tap Taps are a kind of character from Yoshi's Island. That's what the little spike ball on my YouTube is. I am named for Tap Taps, which are about... Like, 25 years old at this point. I've had the name for 10 years. Uh, nothing to do with Tap Tap Fish. I hate the name Tap Tap Fish. Um, and yeah, my channel is not focused around this game. I barely, I barely look at this thing at all. This is the first time I've looked at my tank for like months. Um, so, unless there's an earth shattering event and Abyssrium World turns good. I mean, Hello Whale turns good. Um, yeah. <laughs> uh, it's uh, probably pretty done with this game. It's not like there's really anything to say. You just do it, literally the exact same thing over and over and over again. And you get new, in like 50 quotation marks, fish that are from the other games. Like, you could just just play regular Abyssrium. It still kind of is poopy, but it's not this poopy. It's like a little lump in a cat box poop versus like elephant poop. This is the elephant poop. This is walrus poop. Oh, manatee, excuse me. Sorry. Um, <laughs> alright. That's, that's, that's quite possibly my, my last Abyssrium World video, and the last thing I talked about was walrus poop, so that's fitting. <laughs> well, thanks for watching. Remember to like, comment, subscribe. There are other games than this. Please, please check out some of my other stuff. I, I check out new games. If you need new games to play, if you're, you know, bored of a terrible game called Hello Whale, um, I have, I play, I try to play a different game every week at the very least. So, if you're bored, try to check out new stuff on this channel. And, um, if there are new mobile games that don't suck, feel free to recommend. Um, nobody ever really seemed to have made a genuinely really good, um, Abyssrium clone, other than, um, Penguin's Island seemed alright. Birdstopia was okay, but they never updated it, and that game's been dead for years, unfortunately. Uh, it could have been good, though. Most of the other ones just kind of sucked. It's so weird, because like, it's such a simple concept. It should be able to, like, just make, you know, um, just make a terrarium game. Just make an above-ground game where you have, like, turtles and, like, lions and stuff, you know? It's almost what Pole was. <sighs> but yeah, Flero Games doesn't care, so <laughs> there we are. All right, gamers, remember to like, subscribe, and smash that bell. Frog, what are you doing in my house? I, I, I would just get out.